Good morning and welcome to Hawks Nest. Today we'll be talking all things sports, starting with men's and women's side of basketball, going into volleyball next, and then ending with football. Hey you guys, welcome to Hawks Nest. I'm Monica Smith. And I'm Jen Bryan, and let's get right into it. Let's talk about women's basketball. Yes. So they opened their 2018-19 basketball season Tuesday night. They went on the road to number six ranked Mississippi State, mm -hmm. um, SEC opponent. Um, so definitely a tough match. They unfortunately yeah. lost, <coughs> but you want to tell more, me more about that? Um, yeah, but um, even though we lost, sophomore Artesia yep. Thompson, she led the team with 19 points. Freshman Taylor Pruitt, she threw up 15 points for the night, so... I mean, we may have lost, yeah. but we did an extremely good job. Yeah, and this game, like, is a great learning experience for the team. They can take things that, you know, Mississippi, Mississippi State does and apply it to their own game. And, right. you know, this will definitely help them down the road when it comes to OVC play. Right. Um, which is the most important part of their season. So Yeah, and to think about it, it's just one game yeah. versus mm -hmm. many, which we're going to win. Yeah, <laughs> that was the first one, so they put up a good effort. So a lot to be proud of, a lot to walk away, Good, po a lot of positives to take from the game. So. Yeah, and same thing with the, um, the men's basketball mm -hmm. team. Like They did a really good job for it to yeah. be their first game They as also well. opened up their season on Tuesday. They went to SLU, and, um, you know, in the first half, they were down 22 points, but in the Second half, they came back within 10. So that is very impressive. Yeah. Yeah, and even though they were down by 10, um, they lost 65 to 75. Mm -hmm. 10 point difference, yeah. that's not too bad. It no. was still a really good game. Yeah. It was really intense, but I mean, hey, we got time to come back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it'll be exciting to see what they do in the end of the season too, especially mm -hmm. in um, OVC play. Right. So b the, both of them will be in Bradley on Saturday. The women okay. tip off at 7 p.m. and then the men tip off at 1 p.m. Okay. So it'll be exciting to see what they do. Yeah, okay, and I'm going straight into mm -hmm. volleyball. Um, they celebrated their senior weekend with back-to-back -back victories mm -hmm. against SIUE and EIU, and they beat both teams 3-1. to one. Yeah, no better feeling as a senior when you walk away with two wins for the weekend, right. especially when you're being celebrated. So, you know, a lot to be proud of. The seniors that were acknowledged were Keegan Fornoff, Haley Billbrook, Madeline Grimm, and Madera Bajari. So okay. all who had phenomenal careers, so hats off to them. Yeah, and um, also they went on a road to Martin, Tennessee mm -hmm. Tuesday night to take on UT Martin. Yeah. They lost 3-1, to one, but, I mean, with them winning senior night, mm -hmm. well, senior weekend, it, yeah. was, it was cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah, and, you know, right now they currently sit in fifth place in the OVC standings. So they mm -hmm. have, they're headed Saturday, they take on Jacksonville State. Okay. Um, in their last OVC match, so hopefully they come out with a win, and it'll be exciting to see what they do as well. Right, and then um, Annie Warheim, um, mm -hmm. she was named OVC Offensive Player of the Week, and she's our newcomer of the week. That is yep. really exciting for yeah. her. I bet she's really excited. Yeah. And um, she led the offense this past weekend with 40 kills, mm -hmm. averaging five kills per set with a .260 hitting percentage. Yeah. Yeah, that was pretty impressive. She is unstoppable, and it'll be very exciting cool to see what she does on Saturday too because she's playing very very good yeah <laughs> so let's go on to your favorite topic football football yes yeah. the best topic mm -hmm. yes okay. <laughs> now you know we're the hottest team yep we're the hottest team yep. out there and um really? obviously <laughs> and uh, we're currently on a five game winning streak yep. and the second week in a row being ranked in the FCS top 25. Yes, coming off of a win against Tennessee State on Saturday, they are mm -hmm. they are currently now no number 19 in the FCS coaches poll. So, Ooh, I am to them. Extremely excited yep. about that. And um quarterback Daniel Santa Catarina and running back Marquez Terry yep. um earned OBC honors on November 4th. Yeah, this is Santa Catarina's third honor for a newcomer of the week and then mm -hmm. Um, Terry earned his second Offensive um, Player of the Week award, so yeah. well deserved. They are the fire, or they are very good mm -hmm. um, for the offense and the powerhouse. I yeah, can say. we please talk about Vargas on Saturday? Yes. Okay. So I was at the <laughs> game, and he brought the he made the atmosphere electric almost. With it, it was experience. hilarious. Yeah. I'm just mm -hmm. like, yes, that's the type of energy that yeah. we need, especially yeah. with us doing so well. Like yeah. really. A really good feeling. Yeah, for and it Simo. pumps up the players. Like they are so like the, if the energy is loud and and fun, then they're gonna go play and exactly. play their top game. So right, and then um, 
Terry became the first team on running back mm -hmm. um, to rush for over 1,000 yards mm -hmm. and back-to-back -back seasons since 1993 and 1994. Yeah, that is something to say. <laughs> he hey. shows up every Saturday. So every he Saturday. Is to watch. <laughs> like, he is so much fun. He is. So good for him. And um, our next game is Saturday yeah. against Murray State. We will win. We will win. We'll <laughs> add that winning streak for oh, sure. Of course. Mm -hmm. And then um, ESPN3 live coverage mm -hmm. as part of the game of the week. Yeah, yeah. So. Yeah, so. You know, a lot to look forward to for CMO Sports this week, and mm -hmm. we look forward to letting you know another recap next week. So, yeah. yeah. So, um, I'm Monica. And I'm Jen. Thank you guys for watching. Yep. Thank Have a you. good day.